Hey, people! Zar Swamp here, and welcome to episode 8 of Worlds End Club Blind! Last time, we did some dialogue at the campsite, we talked to the, our fellow classmates, and we got their thoughts on the matter. Then we had to debate on where we're going to go next. Were we going to go to Oita, or were we going to go to Fukuoka? And after doing some thought, I decided to choose going to Fukuoka because it had more characters that I liked. So now we're heading off there. Let's go. Yeah, we're gonna get the wrath of Pi. We dissed her hometown. Like Oida for there. life. And now we got a garbage. Hey, we got the video game company. We passed through so many cities and I haven't seen a single person. <laughs> Wait, what's going on? Where's your usual big mouth response? Well, he got egg on his face! I bet he's regretting splitting with the Oita group, too. You, you idiot! Not for a minute! Oh, if Mochon were here, he'd be so Yes, happy. he'd be able to consume several food stands. I'm seeing one... I've seen some of the food stands right there. Just look at all these foods. Exactly. Stands. Lots of shops, but nothing to eat. It'd be like torture for him if you ask me. He'd find a way. He eat you. Maybe you're right. Anyway, who gives a crap about them? No point hanging around here. Let's get moving. Get moving? Where to? Well, I guess all we can do is head east. Remember, the main goal is still to get to Tokyo. And what if we get to Tokyo and there's no one there? Anyway, let's go. Yeah, what are we going to do then? If we get to Tokyo and we, we have nothing. Yeah, apparently there is a splitting path mechanic in this game. So, yay! Another actual gameplay portion! Hooray! Hey, can we rest soon? I've just about had it. Why are we taking this mountain path anyway? Wouldn't it be smarter just to follow the coast? No choice. It's what our so-called leader decided. Really? When are we just gonna overthrow him? The mountain path looks shorter on the map. That's probably why. I bet Kansai didn't even think about the difference in elevation. The fact that we're calling a mountain. Does even have a brain? He has a mouth. Is that a rhetorical question? <sighs> the air sure is fresh up here. Really, Kansai? We're just gonna overthrow you soon. Right? Aren't I right? Uh, huh? Uh, I wish Genu and Aniki were here. Why? So we could have Aniki pull a giant cart? Yeah. Maybe those two could keep Kansai under control a little. And we don't have any ditzes in this group either. Yeah. If Mochan were here, he'd lighten the mood for sure. No, Mochan wouldn't lighten the mood. He'd be complaining that his feet would be hurting, and how gravity is working against him even more than normal. I hope they're okay. <sighs> but can we just acknowledge the charge on Pochi's game system? Really, that thing's been going nonstop. <sighs> what? What's wrong? Why is everybody looking so down? Hey. You know what the bartender said when a horse walked into the bar? Why the long face? Okay, really, Kanzai? You think that corny jokes are gonna be your way to stardom? Or they're gonna elevate you in the group eyes of the group? <laughs> really, we're just gonna push you down the mountain. <clears throat> lame. Lame? What do you mean, lame? Come on, it's 
like a dad joke. It's not like a dad joke. It is a dad joke. Forget dad joke. It's more like a granddad joke. You guys don't know classic humor when you hear it. Wait. What now? Is it the mothership here to take Kantai away? The sky. Look up in the sky. Yes, yeah, snow. Snow? Snow? What the heck? It's July 31st. Snow in the middle of summer? We're on a mountain. Kansai's lame jokes broke the weather. <laughs> yes. Give me a break. It was a good joke. And then the thunder's gonna Maybe flash. It's gonna sound. Of the great king of Angoma. The year 1999, seventh month from the sky will come a great king of terror. To bring back to life the great king of Aglamus. One of Nostradamus's prophecies. Oh. Placking intensifies. Uh, uh. What the heck? What's wrong? The sky. Look up in the sky again. What are we going to see? If what? More snow? Okay, yes, little girl dropping from the sky. Okay, is you go drive any faster? What? No way. That's oh. I guess that's what dad jokes do. They summon girls from the sky. Great, now Kanz is gonna probably tell you more dad jokes. You're the so-called leader, Kansai. You figure it out. Don't ask me. Why don't we just leave her over there somewhere? <laughs> yes, Chuko, just toss out you and me. We can't do that. <sighs> She's waking up. Um, who are you? Uh, I I'm the leader of the Go-Getters Club. People call me Kansai. My favorite food is takoyaki. My least favorites are broccoli and green peppers. Uh, dude, you're totally oversharing. <laughs> hey, you, how long are you planning on getting carried around like a princess? The prince didn't carry Snow White that long, and <laughs> she was poisoned. <laughs> Man, Chuko would just be delivering throwing some shade. Chuko doesn't give a crap if you fell out of the sky. Chuko, she's basically just, you're walk, you have legs, you walk. Oh. Please forgive me. By the way, you all are... We're the happy-go-lucky go-getters club! Except when we're arguing about... Oh, about Oida versus Fukuoka. I'm Tatsu. I'm Niora. They call me Pochi. Hmm. That's Chuko. She's being super nasty right now, but deep down she's a nice girl. When? What do you mean super nasty? Watch your big mouth. And that one over there is Rachel. Like the player character in a video game, he basically has no personality. <laughs> I'm trying to get my thoughts about you, Kansai! This is an all of the Go-Getters Club. We had a disagreement and decided to split up. Oh, I see. So, who are you anyway? I'm... I'm... Um... Who am I anyway? 
You mean, you don't even know who you are? Mukuro Ikusaba, the 16th student hidden within the school. Watch yes. out for her. I can't seem to remember anything. Not even coming down from the sky? Coming down? From the sky? <laughs> Please don't tease me. <sighs> it looks like she's serious. Yeah, and I don't get the feeling she's lying either. Maybe she has amnesia like Pi. Probably. Okay, nothing we can do then. W wait a second! You can't just say nothing we can do and leave it at that! <laughs> she came floating down from the sky! Does that seem normal to you? Good point. Then again, we saw monster plants in Kagoshima. Yeah, I'm getting and to the where demon nothing dog. surprises me. Yep, even people coming down from the sky is like, okay, ho hum. Ah! Yeah, Rachel. Anyway, this girl. What do we do with her? You've got no memory. So maybe you don't even know what to do. Yes, it's true. I can't even remember where my home is. If Pi was here, she'd be saying it's in Oida. Because everyone who matters lives in Oida. Well, well, um, so do you want to come with us? The more the merrier. You guys okay with that, right? Y yeah, of course. Me too. I have no particular objections. Just going to let this weirdo come with us? Like you're one to talk, Chuko? Weirdo? What's so weird about her anyway? How about the fact she floated down from the sky and has no memory? That ring a bell? She's creepier than a guy in a trench coat lurking around at night. Oh, I. Please forgive me. Can you stop apologizing? You're making me look like the bad guy. Careful, Chuko! Otherwise, you're gonna watch a Wizard of Oz parody. Next thing you know, you're gonna be stat you're gonna you're gonna have your throat slit, and you're gonna be taped to a pillar. Enough already. It's a majority decision no matter what Chuko says. This girl is coming with us. Besides, we can't just leave her here in a place like this. What is that? It's the Go-Getters Club Sign of Friendship. Sign of... Friendship? You're one of the gang. That's what it means. The gang? You're... Letting me join the gang? Darn straight! <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's that. Better get off this mountain before the snow piles up. Okay, we were told this was an act, so yeah. can we actually move? Let's go. Can some gameplay? Bye, Chuko! Uh, seriously? It's already starting to pile up as we speak! Because you're walking so slow, that's why! Blaming this on me? <laughs> Please calm down, Miss Chuko. Hey, quit acting like the referee here! Besides, I still don't recognize you as part of the group, okay? <sighs> By the way, what should we call her? Right. It would be better if she had a name. Why not just call her Flower? She's as white as Flower. <laughs> <laughs> hmm, let's see. What else is white? I got it. Let's call her Yuki since it means snow. I mean, she fell down from the sky like snow, too. Hmm, not bad. Yuki, huh? Yeah, it's a great name. I think it fits her perfectly. Yuki? Yuki? No good? No, 
I don't mean that. I think it's a very charming name. Whew. I'm really glad you like it. <laughs> I swear, Truco is just a comedy show. Anyway, we should hurry. We have to get down the mountain before nightfall. <laughs> what is up with them? And meanwhile, Poshi, he, he just doesn't give a damn. He just wants to be his high score. Huh? Where did Miss Chuko and Mr. Pochi go? I thought they were right behind us. What are they going so slow for? Aren't we going to be in trouble if we keep dragging our heels? Yes, we can freeze to death on the mountain, considering that everyone is, that most of the group is wearing shorts. How are, really, Tatsun? Tatsun, Doc Girl, how are you not freezing? Yeah, I don't yeah, want to think about something in the snow. I'm sorry for slowing you down so much earlier. Don't worry, it's not your fault, Yuki. It's the slow pokes in the back that are the problem. I am so royally ticked off! What are you so worked up about? Worked up? I'm not worked up! I think you are. <laughs> Maybe you're just getting hungry. What? Here, take this. Maybe some food will help you calm down? Yes. Caramucho. Okay, so are we playing as these what two? What is it? So spicy, it shouldn't be this good. It's Caramucho. Oh so no! Mochan gave me some when we were in Kagoshima. Oh. Yeah, we're dealing with her weakness of spicy. Oh, but that's judging, right. You can't handle spicy food. Yeah, huh? though, judging from the intro, the little intro cinematic that we got after escaping the. The game of fate. She apparently will have fire powers. So that's not true. Stop treating me like a child. Okay. Then. You guys are children. Uh, you don't have to force yourself, okay? I'm totally not. I can eat them, no problem. Spicy food rocks. Really? Really, Chuko is really not growing me as a character. I mean, she it feels like she's Yoko done right. Where basically she's this bratty child, but she's just over the top tsundere that's kind of endearing. Nom, nom, nom. Well. Get some milk, girl. That is, water's not gonna help you. Uh, I told you. No, no, no! I can't take it anymore. Water! Where's the water? Water, 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 water! Oh, Chuko. It looks like we finally caught up. Or she go get some dragon powers? No way! I got a bad feeling. Everyone, run! Huh? to its Hunjuray form. It has the power of an ultimate Hunjuray. Nah, but no Hunjuray can top Maki. No one can top Maki role in the Hunjuray department. What was that? I don't know. Something came out. Did a fireball just come out of Chuko's mouth? Wow! 
Okay, I have the, the I I'm having the theory that we're gonna have to go back and we're gonna ha go have to go back in time and play all the roots. That's Ms. my Chuko, guess. I didn't know you were a monster. I am not. Maybe it's related to Rachel's mysterious ability. Yes, we have to see that image every time. Mochan's body turned into iron and Kato's Looked more like stone to me. Hey, Juko, what happened? I don't know. You tell me. So can you play the hey, game? Thank you very much. S stop it. It's not like... Seriously, I owe you one, too. Thanks. Yes, happy Rachel is good, way, Rachel. Where's Pochi? Huh? I thought he was right behind me. <laughs> yeah, Pochi's just gonna stand there for the rest of the what game. What's going so slow for? Let's go look for him. What the heck? Where'd Pochi go anyway? Maybe he got lost. It's a straight path. Pochi, can you hear me? Answer me. No reply. Uh, we're just gonna have to split up and look for him. Use the walkie-talkies if you find him. Understood. Everyone splits up. All right, Rachel, let's go. We have to find Pochi before this turns into a blizzard. Hey now, don't leave Yuki behind. Yuki said it was update. Go to the collection. Go Gears Club on the pause menu to see. It probably. Oh, she can breathe fire now. We have a fire breathing tsundere on our side now. Hooray! Okay. Wow, we're playing as a different character. Okay. Man, this girl can jump! What was she drinking? Tito's milkshake? Yes, the cold and frozen river. Hmm? I heard nothing. What are you talking about? Okay, we're probably gonna have to use our powers. It's a dead end. Let's head back. All right. Hey, what are you doing here? <laughs> I was just tagging along. Why? Because she's part of the group now. Because I don't have a walkie-talkie. <sighs> Someone! Help me! Wait, did the charge your battery was... finally go out? It sounded like Pochi. I think it came from over there. There's no way to go any further here. You have fire powers. Why can't we just use the fire powers? Oh, I just thought of something. Remember you puked up yeah. a fireball to melt the falling icicles just before? That was a single icicle. What are you talking Can about? Can you not say puke? Anyway, you could do the same thing again here. Okay, I got it. Let me try. Oh. Nothing's coming out. Why can't we use our throwing ability to toss people over? I don't know. You! It's your fault you made me do such a nasty thing! Maybe you need something to help get the fire started. Get the fire started? Oh, we're probably going to have to pick up something spicy. I don't know. Maybe. What is that? It's Karamucho. Pochi gave me some earlier. So if you eat some, will you be able to make fire again? I'm not sure. Well, this will be a test. Let's give it a try. Try eating the Karamucho. Uh, 
Um, is something the matter? Sh shut up! It's nothing! Huh? Ugh, fine. You want me to eat it? I will! Cougar's Awakened Ability, Fiery Maiden. Press the body skill button when you want to use this ability. When Chuko eats Kamachuro, her mouth turns red and swells up. A blast of intense flame shoots out of her mouth. Chuko's data was updated. Hooray. Just down the entire bag. Yes, just fire breathing ability. Hooray! You did it, Miss Chuko! See, Miss Chuko? You really are a monster! <laughs> I said I'm not! But you spit out a fireball. No mere human could do that, right? You're one to talk. At least I didn't come floating down from the sky. Yeah, as it said, when you were born, you probably rose from the earth and from a fiery chasm. Let me go. I said let me go. What, are we going to find Haiji on the mountain? Haiji became a mountain man. Looks like we don't have time for talk. Yes, let's go. Which we'll do in the next episode. Anyways, I really appreciate that you took time to watch this episode. You're great. If you want to be good for the next one, if you like the video, like, subscribe, comment, share it to us that you want. With that, I'll see you next time. Bye.